Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Autos. In this video, I will show you or will be discussing with you how does extension work for Capital One Shopping or a review of Capital One Shopping. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So in this case, you might be wondering how does it actually work? What is Capital One shopping? So we'll be discussing all those details. Now in this case, first thing we need to do here is we first have to visit the Capital One shopping website. Now in this case, open up any browser that you have. So in this case, I'm using Google Chrome and I went to CapitalOneShopping.com. Now once you go in their website, you should be able to see the main UI. Now immediately you should be able to see this UI here which includes different personal personalized deals depending on how you actually interact with your browsers and also you'll be able to browse for brands, products, collections, and blog. So we'll be uh, looking into all those links uh, later on. So in this case you might be wondering what is Capital One Shopping? Well Capital One Shopping actually helps you find the best prices online. Like in this case, like for example, if you're looking for a product that you really want to buy, but you want to save up, save up on some funds so, for, so that you'll be able to spend it on other things. So Capital One would actually be a great tool or platform for you to look for those products to, or to just basically save up on those products. So uh, an example on its usage is comparing prices. Like for example, in Amazon, you're looking for like a t-shirt. So you really like this specific t-shirt here, this specific brand of t-shirt. And uh, in this case, you're looking for a low, lower cost or something that would actually help you save up on money. Now, in this case, Capital One is a great one or a great tool that you could use basically. Now, in this case, it is a tool that you use if, you re if you're big on shopping and whatnot. So one of its uses is uh, comparing prices and differences on those products comparing cost helps you set up price drop alerts so if you want to basically be notified on a specific price or a um, sale on a specific product you could set that up as well so you could also uh, help or you could, you'll be able to find awesome deals via this tool and this uh, platform here and also it works as a universal product search so in this case you might be wondering well i could do this manually well in this case, Capital One actually makes things a lot easier for you since it will automatically help you find all those deals. So, uh, for example, yeah, you can do this manually, but in this case, like if you use their pro their platform or their uh, software here, you'll be able to basically search more or you'll be able to see more awesome uh, price drops or sale on specific products or uh, products that you want to buy. So imagine doing this like 20 times, 10 times searching for just a uh, lower cost product. So Capital One is a great help, especially if if there's an event or it's Christmas season or any season or event that you want to be save up on. Now in this case, how do you actually start using Capital One Shopping? Well, using it is actually pretty easy. So what we need to do is we need to basically visit their website here. So typically when you actually load or reload their, their website here, usually there's going to be pop up here that says add, Chrome, add to Chrome, it's free. But you could actually view this. So if you click on anywhere and you miss that, you also have the link here. So it says add Capital One Shopping to Chrome. So just click on it. And from here, it's going to load up the Chrome web store wherein you'll be able to add these extension here. So let's just click on add to Chrome here and just click on add extension. So it's going to start the download and the installation process of the extension itself. So let's just wait for it to finish. But when it's finished, you should be able to see that S. Now also, if you click on the uh, plugin icon or extension icon here you should be able to see the capital one shopping icon here just click on the pen here and from here you should be able to see it immediately now in this case uh we need to do here so typically when you actually reload the onboarding site here it's going to give up or it's going to ask you to fill out all necessary details here so that includes your name and some personal information just to set up your account here so once you've done that you'll be able to start creating your account now going back into the main website for Capital One, so there are a, a, 
a few things that you can view here. Like for example, for brands, you should be able to see like for apparels, automotive and vehicle, beauty and health, books and movies and music, and a lot more. So basically, it covers a wide range of categories. So it's you'll be able you'll be able to definitely look for products that you want to uh, buy in here. Now, also the product section here, they have their own categories as well, as well like for appliances, arts and crafts, books, baby products, health and home and kitchen supplies. So a lot. So you also have the collections here. So depending on the season, the, their collection actually uh, changes. So pet gift guide, our must give gifts collection, home gift guides. If you want to view those collections, just click on those collection and you should be able to see those specific collections. Now, also, you have the option for blogs. So if you want to have or you're preferring for a mass gift giving, it's going to give you ideas on what to uh, search. Like, for, so for example, tech gift guide or must have give, uh, give gifts and a lot more. So if you're not sure how would you actually give or uh, give your friend or your family members, this is a great way to, to have an idea on what you want to uh, give them. Now, also at the top section, you have the help section and the terms and privacy. Now, with any platform that you visit, it's really important that you read through their terms of service. So in this case, if you read through all those information like privacy and policy here, it's not only help you inform about what you can do and what not do in the platform itself, it helps you protect yourself so something just in case something went wrong or something that actually got your account closed you'll know your rights and you know what to do uh, later on since you know what are the terms of service or privacy policy within on that platform so it is recommended that you read through all the terms of service and privacy policy as well now if you need assistance on capital one shopping so this is the help page here you'll be able to uh, view different information about tourism like for example common questions uh, common things that you could do here and a lot more so they also have useful links here that you could visit so that you'll be able to uh, basically uh, fix any problems that you have or encounter in your account so yeah, so here uh, on the section here, once you've logged in, uh, usually this section here, it will be personalized depending on what you search. So if you want to search for a specific product, just click on search product or brand here and you'll be able to find the item that you want. Yeah, in this case, it's going to give you the best deals here. So yeah, so that's the general uh, thing or the general uh, purpose of Capital One Shopping. It helps you find the best deals for your account to save up on different products. So for example, you found a product that is on sale, like for example, it's on 8%, but through the user capital one, you could basically search for better deals. Like for example, you'll be able to find 10% off or more depending on what is available right now. So capital one is a, think of it as a universal uh, searching tool for sales. So that's what Capital One is. But yeah, so this one is actually pretty simple. You just need to sign in, sign up, look for a product, and from there you should be able to see different deals that you'll be able to use or basically buy if you want to and Capital One. So that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.